job. Brother not responding, but worse. Dad's in the hospital. No clue of what condition he's in. Trying so fucking hard to find answers. Feels like a giant ship ball is rolling and it keeps getting larger. The news problem is money. More exact, my father's medical bills. Which, if you live in this great country of the US of A, you know just how big they can get. People also know no insurance, you're essentially completely fucked. Fuck this job, fuck my boss. Fuck the corporation that owns this little shithole of a company. No insurance for the hard work employees like me. Some bullshit about working for the place for six months. Worst of all, family is no help. Dad retired long ago. Used up his remaining money on poor investments and a nasty divorce my cunt of a mom. She would probably want to see my dad dead if I would take a guess. My younger brother has fucking nothing can never hold on to a job for a period of time, not even two days, basically lives off my dad the rest of his life. Since my shithead brother has no use to help out, I'm trying to think of other ways to make money. I can try to gamble, but honestly fuck chance. Also I can't count cards to save my life. Selling drugs I can't do anymore. May have got me through high school and college, but I'm just too old for it now. I get caught in a second. I can't lose the fancy job at the company. I just can't. I have absolutely nothing to sell. Grandpa didn't leave me some valuable toy. I can just pawn away for some quick cash. Uncle Bill has some expensive cars. But Dad and him don't get exactly along. Besides, he never considered my brother and I be family because we were adopted. Fuck him. So here, I'm stuck trying to figure out how to save my dear father. Still fucking clueless. The giant ship all just rolling and getting bigger and bigger. Will someone just tell me how dad is doing? For all I can know, he could be dead already. The system might just be fucking with me. I'm trying to take all I got. Hello, this is Dr. Stevens in. Calling you to give an update on your father. He is going to surgery right now. Um, that's all much we can give you. Um, other details is meet the payments as soon as you can. There is one way I can get the money. Let's just say it's an old job. It's probably too risky. Too stupid for me to go back. <sighs> I have no options. My little brother has probably thought about it. Maybe. We were partners in this business. We're actually some of the best at what we did. A thrilling job, but absolutely fucking stupid of us to do. Good thing Dad never found out. Still will never tell him. Even if he's going to be dead or alive tomorrow, there's no way he will ever find out. The old job is all I can think of. It's literally the only way I can get the money and get rid of this big fucking problem. Fuck morals and doing the right thing, that doesn't fucking matter. Saving one of the only people you'll ever love seems like the most important aspect at this moment of time. Fuck morals. Is this you? It's me, Connor. Listen. Fuck. I'm in 
huge struggle. My father, he has fucking triple bypass surgery. Can you give me a job tonight? Any, any job. Listen, I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry about that. It, it's, I wanted to get out of it. I've had this great job. It's been good, but nothing. Fuck my dad. My dad's in triple bypass surgery. I need this. All right. When do you need it, Bob? As soon as possible. Tonight, Bob. Tonight? Yes, tonight. Yeah, of course. Okay. Tonight's great. Be ready. I'll call you with more details soon. Good. I can't believe I followed through with it. I went back to the old job. Now my life is going to continue with me waking up every day wondering if I'm going to end up dead. <sighs> but I made a commitment. I gotta do what I gotta do. But still deep in my mind, I wanted to think of an alternative. Listen, I've been getting cold messages, doctors, every, everyone's telling me yeah, that dad's not doing good, I need someone to call me back, what's going on, what the fuck is going on, also, how, I'm also getting told by doctors we can't pay for this shit, how are we going to get the fucking money for this, I need you to call me back right now, right now, alright, right when you get this. I was the only one looking out for my father to save him. Save him by getting money for his surgery. But the fucked up thing is, I'm the one who's being kept out of the dark about his condition. It's just insane. How do I even know this job will even save him? How do I know he won't die from the surgery? Either way, I'm doing this because I care. Vince, where the fuck have you been? Didn't you get my fucking message? How's dad doing? I took him to a six hour surgery when I left. Six hour surgery? What the fuck does that mean? It means exactly what it means. It took him to a six hour surgery. What's the status? What what the doctors say? The doctors aren't telling me shit, but we have to pay them. I don't know. Like I looked on the internet though. It says he has a high chance. High chances? Is that good? It's better than low. Anyways, doctors told me we had to pay this up. How are we gonna do that? How much money do you have? 2000. <laughs> Seriously, how much money you fucking have? You really wanted a nice job. I just started at that job. I don't even have benefits or anything. Why would you take that job then? Because I wanted to get out of this fucking other shithole job that I was getting at every fucking risk every day doing. Fuck. What well, we had to do it then? What job? I called Louie. Call Louie? You're not doing that. You're not getting I'm back in that business. It. I'm doing it because you don't have fucking any money to pay for this. To even fucking help me. Of course I have to do it. You even have a gun? Yeah, of course I have a fucking gun. You're not doing this. You're not. I'm you're not doing, doing this. It doesn't matter. What do you think Dad would think? He he adopted us. He raised us to be good people. <laughs> that that doesn't matter. He cares about us just the same. If <laughs> that doesn't fucking matter, all right? I'm doing this. Does 
He's gonna be happy that we even put up the money to do this. He'll be even pro probably even be happier. I'm leaving. You're not doing that. I am doing this. I'm gonna figure a way to pay for dad by not doing that. If you don't support, then fucking leave. Now I know I'm officially alone with this operation. The only partner I ever had doesn't even want to follow through with it. Not even for his own fucking father. But now's the time that I need to follow through with it. Back at it again. The old stomping ground. After three years of being retired from this business, I never thought I'd come back. But at the most crucial of times, I guess it's meant to be. Fuck you doing here. You gotta sing. Do you have a sing? What do you want? Can you back you up? Now you can't go back me up. When we first got in the business, we were always partners. When we were making the most money, we were partners. Before we even exited the business, we were partners. That's funny. Because earlier, you were mentioning how dad wouldn't be proud of this, how it's all immoral and all that bullshit. That's exactly right, but this is family we're talking about. That's the only time you will ever do things like this, is when... So now you see my sense of urgency, now you see our sense of urgency that you should have had earlier. You know? This is a situation we're in. I know what's best for the family, all right? While mom's in Malibu fucking looking for her next million dollar baby to fuck her, we're basically taking care of dad, all right? We gotta do what we gotta do. Fuck the situation we're in. Fuck the financial ability. We're doing this. I'm glad you joined me, little brother. Thank you. Yeah.